Hey BOSU fans, what's going on? It is your trainer, Coach Katie, and then we have Epo joining us and Catherine today for an amazing house hit workout on our balance trainer. So meet us in a seat and then go ahead and bring your legs nice and wide. If you can't go too wide without bending your knees, that's okay. So if your knees are bent and you wanna stick here, totally fine. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna kinda use the balance of the trainer to get us a little bit of an extra stretch. So go ahead and take your arms up to the sky on an inhale. Then exhale any amount. Go ahead and reach your arms in between the, your legs and stretch. So I like to flex into my spine here, round into my spine, and hold. Whew. Nice job. Breathe. Stretching out the inner groin. Four, four, three, final two, and one. Very slowly roll all the way up. Inhale, arms are going to reach. Exhale, go ahead and take that right arm through. That left arm is going to reach up and stretch. Big inhale, reach those arms up. Exhale, switch over other side. Hold. Three, two, one. Inhale back to center and switch. Center, switch, center. Yes, you guys got this. Let's go. Four, four, three, final two. Last one, landing on that side, add a little pulse. Woo! Nice job, let's get it. How we doing, Epo? He's grooving, let's get it. Nice, four, three, two, switch, other side. Find that bounce. Phew, Catherine, how we feeling over there? She loves it. Nice job, she's only heard it three times today, so she better like it. Just kidding, three, two, one, then dive and fold. This time, extend through your upper spine. So rather than rounding, you're gonna find some extension, and then fold, try and get those forearms on the ground if possible. Nice, Whew. breathe, go ahead and bring those arms out wide, bend at the elbows, then shift it right, left. I want you to kind of sweep that upper body through. Nice job, then add a pulse, pressing that chest down as if you were doing a pseudo push-up. Remember, if you're bending at the knees, totally fine. Three, two, roll through the spine, rise it up. Whew. Then go ahead and bring those heels towards us. Toes are gonna point up. Scoot yourself a little bit further forward on your balance trainer if needed. Reach those arms, find a little bounce, and then push the weight forward. Yes. You're gonna feel that resistance from your trainer. Totally fine. For four, Woo. three, final two, and one. Nice job. Hold, stretch it out. Oh my goodness. Huh. Staying right here. Four, four, three, two, one. Slowly roll through the spine. And go ahead and bend at those knees. Then go ahead and open up those legs and take a moment and stretch it out in a low squat. So you're using the resistance of your arms to press on your thighs, lifting up through your chest. So I'm gonna show you from the side really quick. You don't wanna round here. You wanna find as much extension through your spine as possible. Light up the erectors in your back and find more activation of your glutes. Stay here for four, three, find that groove, two, and one, what I want you to do is reach your hands as close to the ground as they'll go, then go ahead and send those hips up to the sky, then sort of shimmy your way as gracefully as possible so that you're making a triangle with the shape of your balance trainer in your feet. So your hands are on the balance trainer, and what I want you to do is I want you to shift your hips way back in space, then reach your arms as far forward as they'll go on the BOSU, and find length in the spine. How's this feel, you guys? Feels so amazing, they say. Whew. Also, if you haven't taken a class with me yet, you're gonna realize that I like to have fun, but I also like to sweat. So things are about to turn up a notch. Yes. <laughs> Epo's making noises in the back. He says, he might be a little scared, but scared in a good way. Scared in a good way, bend in those knees, roll to the spine, rise it all the way up. Arms are gonna reach up. Then go ahead and heel toe those with feet, hip distance. Then turning it up with some cardio. I want you to 
tap your toes on the balustrade. Yes. You can do whatever you want with your arms. So I like to just freestyle it. Yeah, like you're in the club, you can hoo, hoo, hoo. I just got back from a Vegas trip, so that's where I'm at. My feet are coming off, that bows you, that's okay. Then go ahead and turn it to the right side all the way around. Whew. Nice job. Then go ahead, other side, let's hit it. You. Nice job, three, two, last one. Inhale, arms are gonna reach. Exhale, go ahead and step that left foot on the trainer. Right foot off, right arm down, left arm up, and stretch. Whew. Got it, three, two, one. You're gonna take that left toe, you're gonna turn it, and then bring it into a lunge. Then take that right palm down, left arm is gonna reach. Find that bounce. It's hard. Nice. Whew. How are we doing, you guys? Whew. Go ahead and take that left palm down. Then go ahead and take that left foot off of the trainer onto the back. Go ahead and drop to your forearms if possible. Drop in the hips and drop the knee if needed. Stretch here. <sighs> so sweaty. What you guys can't see is it's about like 80 degrees in here right now. If your foot or your knee is coming off, that's fine, but what I want you to do is I want you to kind of bring your hips down and up, finding a deeper stretch in that right hip flexor and in the groin. Yes. Nice job for four, three, two, last one. Go ahead and take your palms to the BOSU balance ball, then go ahead and step the feet back, drop the knees, flip the trainer, Grab the handles and hold. Stay right here. Nice job. Bring it to a plank. And what I want you to do is climb that mountain right to left. Yes. Phew. Bringing your hips up, belly in. Nice job. Four, three, final two. Last one. Here's the move. You go out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in. Woo! You got it. Last set. Oh gosh, I'm off. Three, two, last one. Drop those knees. Oh my God. How was that, you guys? <laughs> easy peasy, easy peasy. Forearms on the BOSU. Go ahead and sink it back into a pseudo child's pose. And then sink that forehead onto the BOSU ball if possible. Nice job. Four, three, final two. Coming up onto your form, step it back, top of plank. Oh my gosh, so hard. Three, two, one. Use your arms, counterclockwise rotate that BOSU ball. Whew. Three, two, last one. Bend at the knees, pop it up, and flip that BOSU back around. Whoo, slowly, slowly, and gracefully roll through all the way up. How we do with that? Ah, you guys are crushing. Jump, squats, bring it on, launch off. On, launch off. I told you it was gonna get really sweaty. Nice job for four, three, final two, last one. Nice job, Lance off. I'm gonna adjust my trainer just so I'm centered. If you guys can see me, go ahead and take that right leg, right foot, place it on the center. Left leg down. Left palm inside that right leg. And then right arm up, stretch. Woo! Oh my goodness, so sweaty. Staying right here. Four, four, three, final two. Last one, right palm is gonna come down. Go ahead and rotate and find that lunge position. That left palm is down, that right arm is up. Take the twist. Whew. Find your balance. Use those abductor muscles, those adductor muscles to find your balance here. Then very slowly bring that right palm down, bend at that knee, then go ahead and slide that right foot off the trainer and take a moment. Forearms can come down and you stretch it out. Those are doing great. Go ahead and lift up the kneecap if possible. 
Stretch. Yes. So you want to find more abduction in that right thigh. So externally rotate that right knee, keeping that right foot planted. Nice job. Three, two, shift the hips. Down, bring it up. Down, up. Down, up. Hold it here. Then place your palms on the BOSU. Step that right foot back. Mountain climb. Yes, 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 yes. You got it. Let's go. Woo. Four, four, three. Final two. One. Pause here. Jack it out. Ow. Nice job. You guys are crushing. Then alternate. In, 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 in. Then press it out. Whew. Three, two. Last one. Hold in that plank position. How do we do with that? Press into the Bosu ball. Activate your serratus. Breathe. Nice. Four, three, two. Last one. Drop it down and then push it back. Woo! All right, so quick tutorial for you. For your plank, I'm doing more of a gymnastic style plank. So you're actually gonna see my back is slightly rounded. That's because I'm flexing in my spine. Your rectus abdominis, your six pack abs, are what flexes your spine. So if you're here, I want you to actually draw your pubic bone up to your face. Draw your rib cage down, pull your belly button in, because those are the style planks we're doing today. Got it? It activates your entire core, and it's hardcore. Hardcore! It's hardcore. <laughs> you know, you know. All right, go ahead and bend at those knees. Hop it up, roll through. Okay, you wouldn't be a BOSU workout without a little balance. So, here we go with a fun balance challenge for you. Left foot on the center of your BOSU. Right leg is gonna come back, either in a regular lunge or a curtsy lunge. I used to play ice, ice hockey as a kid, so this skill is one that I worked on throughout my entire life. These guys, not as much, but they're still amazing. So they're gonna be modifying a bit, follow them if you need it. Otherwise, go ahead and take that right leg back in space, and I want you to bring it down, up, down, up. Making sure that left foot is firmly planted, Four, four, three. We'll go slow. Two, and one. Here's the move. Down, then tap and bring it up. Then down, then tap, bring it up. Down, tap, bring it up. Down, tap, bring it up. Speed it up. Down, up. Down, up. Yes. Nice job, Evo. Four, four, three, final two, last one. Hold it here and lunge. Oh my God, how are your legs feeling? Woo! Leg burner for sure. You've got it. Four, three, final two, and one. Then I, what I want you to do is actually square off your body so that your feet Hard alignment with your hips. Then, you're gonna take that left hip, rotate it backwards. Left heel on the BOSU, toe up, and fold. Hands, hammy stretch, calf stretch. Find a little pulse. Whew. I am breathing, sweating today. You got this. Four, four, three, final two, and one. Nice job. Go ahead and plant that left foot back. Then go ahead and step it back into a lunge position. Left foot is gonna come down and fold. Set at those knees, roll through. Ha! <sighs> How do we do with that? Easy, easy peasy. Remember, your balance is going to vary from day to day. So you might be coming to this workout being like, I cannot balance at all. Totally fine, it changes. But what I want you to do is try your best. Left leg is gonna cut, right leg is back. And you're simply gonna switch, switch with a little hop. Modify if you need. Yes, Epo, for four. Yes, you at home, three, two. Last one, other side. Lunge, bring it up. Nice job, lunge, up. 
four, four, three, two. Last one, what I want you to do is lunge, then kick. Oh my gosh, lunge, then kick. Lunge, kick. Last one, lunge, kick. Then speed it up. Oh my gosh, this side is way worse for me. Whew. Even the pros have a hard time sometimes. For four, three, two. Last one, hold it here, double lunge. Oh my God. Four, three, two. Last one, hold. How we do? So crazy. Go ahead and square off those feet with your hips. Then go ahead and take that right hip, rotate it back in space, left hip forward. Heel down, toe up, fold, stretch it out. Holy moly. Whew. Did you realize that one side is better than your other? What side's better for you, Catherine? Her, her, it's our left, but your right is better for Catherine. That is not my good side. <laughs> to go ahead and dive, maybe find a little pulse, pulse. In three, two, one. Go ahead and step that foot back on. Then square it off in a lunge. Right foot is gonna come back in space. Go ahead and flip the bow to ball. And as gracefully as you can, I want you to step it back, plank. These are called lizard hops. We'll go nice and slow to start. Here's the move. You flex in your hip, you bring it up. Right heel's gonna come up, right toe, or right heel's down, right toe's up, got it? Push that balance trainer away, switch. Yes, you can modify by mountain climbing if needed. Hold, we're gonna speed it up. Three, two, speed it up, switch. Switch, switch, switch. Get some air time. Whoo! Four, four, three, final two. Last one, back to those mountain climbers, just because I love you. You've got it, four, three, two. Last one, hold plank. Nice job! Stay here, three, two, one. Drop those knees. Take a break. Oh my good golly gosh. I am sweating up the storm. Okay, what I want you to do now is kick those legs forward. Scoot yourself close to your BOSU ball. Then go ahead and bring your feet in the center of the trainer, but equally on the right and the left. So pretty close to the handles. Then, very, very slowly, bring it all the way down to the ground. Scoot yourself and adjust as needed. Knees up. Then find a bridge, lift it up, hold. Oh my God. Nice job, stay right here, not moving. Breathing for four, three, two. Last one, glute bridges, bring it down, two, up, two. Finding that balance. You got it, try not to move that BOSU ball. You've got this four. Three, two, one. Okay, here's the hard part. Your right foot is gonna come on first. So our left, their right. Go ahead and bring that right foot onto the center of your trainer, or maybe slightly out to the edge, whatever is easiest to you. Find your way, scoot yourself a little bit closer. Right leg is, or excuse me, left leg is coming all the way up. Big inhale, bending in that right knee if you need, and then exhale, shut those hips to the sky. Oh my God, you've got it. Burn, baby, burn. Burn that booty. Three, two, little pulse. Shove those hips to the sky. <laughs> yes, you've got this, Evo. Stay here for four, three, two, and one. You've earned a break. Left ankle is going to cross on top of that right knee. Thread the needle and pull it through. Oh my goodness. How'd we do, you guys? It was bootylicious, he says. That's what I like to hear. Very, very slowly. Go ahead and bring that leg down. Bring that left foot to meet the right. Then go ahead and bring those feet nice and wide. Then roll vertebrae by vertebrae up. Whew. Little arm work, because why not? Go ahead and take that bow suit in front of you. 
This might be hard. This Bosu ball is fairly heavy. But you got it because you're strong. You're strong. Ugh, show them your guns. Ha! Get that Get that pump moving. Bring that Bosu up. Bring it up. Nice job. Breathe. You're just hanging out. Nice. So finding upper body extension here, then flex forward, bring it back. Nice job, bring it up. Finding that tempo up to beat when you're ready, bring it down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead and very slowly pull it into your chest. Then go ahead and set that Bosu trainer down. How we do? She's shaking, she's sweating, so am I. I'm dying. Okay, what I want you to do now is I want you to flip it around. So we're gonna come to the side just so you can see us. I've tried this move a few times and it feels really funny, but what I want you to focus on here is I want you to focus on your core strength. So what you're going to do is you're gonna bring your feet a little bit wider than hip distance on your balance trainer. Then bring your arms slightly in front of your shoulders. You have, you have to have super strong shoulders to do this. So get them in alignment. Bring your feet out at a 45 and hold. So I'm gonna show you once. Here's the move. You're gonna find momentum and you're going to hop it off and hop it off. Got it? So up the tempo. Find, try and find your uh, transverse abdominis by pulling the belly button in. You hop it. On, off, on, off. It's a fun move. Make sure your core is nice and strong. Nice, keep it up. Whew. And three, two, last one, knees on. Go ahead and bring those knees together this time. Then walk those shoulders out. Okay, so here is the tendency. Your tendency is you're gonna to wanna to like twerk it out. Don't do that, flex in the low body, draw the pubic bone up to your face, core on nice and strong, extend that right toe, push it down, bring it up. Yes. Three, two, last one, hold it nice and low, lift up that right toe heel. Woo! Three, two, one, press it back, stretch it out. Oh, how do we do with that? He says that he likes it. I see the sweat literally pouring from every pore of Evo right now. Yeah, if that's you at home, that's perfect. That's what we want. Okay, coming back, oh, hands slightly in front of those shoulders. Then that left knee is gonna stay on at the trainer as we slowly, slowly, three, two, one, push it down, lift up that opposite leg, breathe. Three, two, add a little pull, slow. Three, two, one, right foot, bring it up. Whew. Three, two, one, very slowly, bring it back and stretch it out. Oh, nice job. Bring that booty behind your Bosu trainer, your balance trainer, and then flip that Bosu back on its belly. Nice job. What's going on with my hair? You flip it. Okay. So, very slowly, bring it all the way down. What we do on the right, we have to do on the left. I'm so sorry, but not at all. That left leg is gonna come to the center. Scooch that booty closer to the trainer if needed. Then go ahead and lift up that right toe. Whew. Good, nice job. Three, two, one. Send those hips up to the sky. Try not to move that Bosu ball. Three, two, one. Find that little pulse. Whew. You've got this. Almost there. Four, four. Three, two, last one. Right ankle stacks on top of that left knee. You've earned it. Go ahead and thread it through if you want. Stretch it out. Yes. Whew. Four, three, two, one. Slowly release. Roll vertebrae above vertebrae up. Okay. Scoot yourself a little bit behind your Bosu ball. 
And we have to finish out one more thing. Your palms are gonna come onto the trainer and your feet are gonna step back into a plank. Roll it clockwise. Yes, I remembered. Yes, let's go. Last set, four, three, two, one. Very slowly drop to those knees. Lift that Bosu ball. And then very slowly step your feet behind and allow your body to drape over your trainer and breathe. Just like we did earlier. So wrap your hands around the front like you're hugging a nice big Buddha belly. Shift your hips back and stretch out your spine. Whew. Nearing the end of our workout, big inhale through the nose. Big exhale out the mouth. Two more, inhale. Exhale. Last breath. Then very slowly roll through the spine, rise it all the way up. Then go ahead and bring your feet on that trainer. You're gonna get nice and, and low into what I call a gargoyle, gargoyle? Gargoyle, I always look at my cameraman. Is it gargoyle? It's gargoyle, he gave me the okay on that. Toes out at a 45. One of my fave moves ever. You're gonna love me for this last one. Heels in, toes out. Very slowly, bring it down. Yes. Then slowly, bring it down. Yes, you can find a little bounce. Slowly, bring it down. Woo hoo I've ducked those, I've ducked those thighs down. Let's go. Bring it down. Yes. Hold it low. Then add a little bounce. Bring it down, up. Woo. You got it. Three, two, one. Slowly set that booty down, and then go ahead and bring those legs out. Arms open. Breathe. Then bring those legs out nice and wide. Toes up, heels down. Big inhale through your nose, arms reach. Exhale, give yourself a nice big bear hug. Some self love. Switch out other side. Stretch out however you need. High five you neighbors. Nice. Yes, high five, high five, high five you guys. You killed it. Thanks for joining us today. We'll see you next time. Let us know what you thought. Whew.